You gotta love Thrasher Grind, underground. And how its customized mode allows you to put yourself right in the game. Now watch me jump the gators. You just got eaten and I just kicked your butt on style points. Again! Woohoo! I mean, woof woof! Johnny, why would you play a skateboarding video game when you could go outside and skateboard for real? I would, Dad, but there's no rad places to skate in Pork Billy, like in Thrasher Grind. Hey, Tess! I got a rad half pipe! For my birthday! There, now you have a rad place to skate and you can stop playing these mindless video games. Honestly, I don't know what the appeal is of these games. <laughs> Almost got it. You know, Test, pipe skating is not like street skating. It's a totally different animal. Step aside and watch the master. Boy, you really showed her, Master. <laughs> Maybe you should stick to your little street tricks and stay off the half pipe. Oh, I don't think so. <laughs> He's really gonna hurt himself, isn't he? Yep, we should probably do something. But nothing says we have to. But he will cease to be our little brother. Fine, we'll help him. Why are you dragging me in here? I've got to show Sissy I'm rad and make her eat her words. And why do you have my game controller? Because we customized it, and it's now the Mega Action Game Controller. Okay, I'll bite. What's so mega about it? It creates a wireless connection directly to the brain's extreme lobe. Just point the controller toward the brain, click the connect button, and you now control that person like in video games. <laughs> I don't like it. Wow, you guys are not total geeks. Thanks, Johnny. I mean, you're still geeks, just not total geeks. And since you're better at Thrasher Grind than me, you work the controller and make me shred Sissy's ramp. Right, now, how does this thing work again? <laughs> Yo, Blakely. Back for more face plants, Test? How about a 1080? It's impossible. That's never been done, except in video games. Oh, yeah? Watch this. You did it! It's the most extreme thing I've ever... <sighs> hey, she fainted from your extremeness! Wait, I have an idea. Let's try swim mode. <laughs> Um, you fainted from my rad moves and I saved your life, duh. Uh-oh. I know that look, Johnny, and forget it. Life is not a big video game where you can control people. And you're not listening to me anymore, are you? I stopped after uh-oh. Give me your money for lunch or I'll give you pain from a punch. Okay. It's punch time! Ow! Ow! Get me away from me! Pop quiz! And it's on stuff I haven't taught yet, so you'll all fail miserably! <laughs> Dork. Ah, uh, nobody ever picks me. Johnny, I don't like being mega controlled. Relax, and let's go for a kick, flip, ollie, bench grind. What? But you never pulled off that trick in the video game. <laughs> 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 that 
Okay, fun's over. Let's put this thing away before someone gets seriously hurt, and by someone, I mean me. No way! I love you, Mega Action Game Controller, and I will never give you up, ever. Johnny, you know the rule. No video games until you finish your homework. <laughs> since when? Uh, since... since I just made it up! Oh, really, Dad? Well... Yes, really. Now upstairs, young man, while I put this thing away. Okay, so I finished my homework, then it's back outside for some mega controlling action. Oh, oh. oh very funny. Now quit controlling me. I'm not. <laughs> well, who is? Playing Johnny's mindless video games is almost as much fun as making meatloaf. Didn't I tell you somebody was going to get hurt? I just can't believe it wasn't me this time. Okay, you were right. Now get the controller away from whoever's using it. What? What is it, boy? You want to go outside? Mm -mm. Hey! Great, now he's playing Thrasher Grind. Susan, Mary! Your dad's playing a video game with the Mega Controller, but he's controlling Johnny at the same time! And Johnny's loose on the streets! Ugh, take five, Lolo. <laughs> you gotta help him! If you don't, I'll bite! I will, too! I'm crazy about that kid! Fine. You hop on Scoots the Scooter and track down Johnny. And we'll run downstairs and get Dad to quit the game. Right, let's move! Whoops, had the thing in reverse. <laughs> Hang on! The girls are gonna get the controller away from your dad! Right! Out of my way, car! <laughs> Sure, it's just a scratch. Look, look, look! Truck! I'm gonna grind it! Hop on, Scoots! Maybe if you're off the board, you can't be controlled! Hey! I think it worked! I'm gonna shred the zoo! No, I don't think it worked! Dad, Lolo's got rabies and he's feeding us senseless with a spoon! So quit the game! I'm sure he's just playing. Ooh, ooh, I'm heading for the gator pit. We need something more important than our safety and well-being to tear him away from that game. Uh, you think your dad could jump the gator pit? I couldn't jump the gator pit. I guess we should probably scream now. Ah! Dad, your, your meatloaf, meatloaf is burning. My meatloaf? Why did you say so? Quick! Turn off the controller! Ah! It stopped! I've got control! Yes, we're alive! Well, it's better than crashing into the gator pit. But probably stinkier. So bored. Need something fun to do. Oh, Johnny! I was wondering if you would put your toys away. Why didn't you just use a door? Right. Oh, ow! Oh, hey, ow! Oh. Done. Toys are away. Johnny, when I said put your toys away, I meant all of them! All of them! All of them! All of them! Thanks, sport. And hey, do a good job and I'll buy you a brand new toy. <laughs> Which is kind of ironic if you think about it. <laughs> uh, just put your toys away. Oh, Dookie. Want to play Go Fetch the Toys and put them away? Uh, I have a two o'clock flea dip, so I'm afraid I can't help you with your <clears throat> little problem. Wait, little problem. That's it. I'll get Susan and Mary to give me some sort of cool ray thing and I'll shrink all the toys so no one can see them. You got all of that from me saying little problem. Yeah, that's right. 
I need a shrink ray. Um. Don't ask. I need a shrink ray so I can make all my toys really small. The Turbo Action Backpack has a built-in shrink ray. I forget, is my head on your body or is your head on my body? Watch as all of my problems just shrink away. It worked! I'm a genius for using my sister's genius! I think that bee may have sprayed wider than you thought. Why do you say that? Because didn't Gil's house used to be there? Oopsies. I'll take care of that as soon as I put all my toys away. Of course. What's the rush? Dookie, is this cool or what? Dookie? Uh-oh. Oopsies again. Don't worry, I'll have you back to normal size. Lickety. Hey, how do you get this thing to unshrink? Whoa, didn't see that coming. SWAT bug now! What is that thing? That's the flea that's been bugging me for the last week! Man, that felt good. Now. Get us back to normal! All I need is a mirror so I can aim the beam at myself and you, and then we'll get big again. Oh, there's a mirror on your... dresser. And now we grow. Wow, the room is spotless. Okay, we'll fix him later, too. Whoa, didn't see this one coming either. Lachu! Lachu! Well, you're real good at Lachu! Shrinking, but your unshrinking leaves a lot to be desired. Let's just get my sisters. Achoo! Will you stop with the sneezing already? My Achoo! allergies are acting up for some reason. Ah! Dinosaurs! They're not dinosaurs, they're dust mites. Tiny microbes invisible to the naked eye that live in bedding, couches, hairy backs, and they make people and dogs sneeze. And they feed off dead skin that falls off humans and animals. Awesome. Hey, do you think they ever get tired of eating dead skin? Yes, now get us out of here. I know, I know. You didn't see that one coming either. Run! How many of these things are there? Well, there are more dust mites in an average room than there are people on the planet. So we're talking more than a hundred. Just get us out of here! Let's try this button. Now's not the time for personal grooming. We're home? Huh. I must have hit the right button. Cool. I'm hungry. Hey, what are we eating? Ham and... Hey, you're me. Maybe we shrank so much we entered a freaky subatomic universe. Subatomic universe? Yes. Some scientists believe every atom in your body could hold a tiny universe so small you can't see it. More importantly, subatomic ham is delicious. Oh, what great horrors await us in this tiny living nightmare! Hey, my subatomic twin looks great! <laughs> Another devilishly handsome talking dog! I'll never be lonely again! Love the sash. <laughs> Welcome to our little home, or should I say our very, very, very little home, where the sun is always shining. Hmm, that's funny. We haven't had a dark, threatening cloud here in years. Oh well, let me show you around. Show me where you keep the ham. Hi, Johnny. Hi, boy who looks exactly like Johnny. We're off to buy you every toy in town, and we love you. Oh, and don't bother cleaning your room. I did it for you. Hi, brother dear. We just finished your homework for you, and we love you. Have we shrunk and gone to heaven? Yep. And there's my girlfriend. That's Sissy. And she looks 
amazing and not freaky at all. Anyway, I'd love to stay and chat, but I've got a show to put on. Do come with us and we'll continue this delightful tour at school. Hurry, come see Johnny Tess, the most popular kid in town, as he reads the phone book. Check it out. I'm the most popular kid in town. Well, I'm off to work. Ta-ta. You work? D dogs work here? If you call being the mayor of this town and getting people to do whatever you want work, then yes. Tiny, Tiny pork belly rocks. rocks! I think I could hang out here for a while. A long while. I'm on it. Hey, can you give us a tour of one of those closets in school that locks from the outside? Yes, of course. Right this way. <laughs> here it is, the closet in school that locks from the outside. Have fun, Mr. Mayor. Same to you, most popular kid in town. <laughs> Well, if it isn't my subatomic girlfriend. Hi, sissy. I hate you. Well, somebody's cranky on stormy, windy days. Oh, well, can't keep my fans waiting. There he is. Get him. What loser My new whiz anywhere you want and give the mayor your steak law didn't go over that well. Well, that explains why they hate you, but why do they hate me? Okay, I think we're safe. Um, we have a small problem. The sky is sort of exploding. According to our calculations, because there are one too many Johnny and Dookies in our universe, the forces that control it are trying to eradicate you through hail, lightning, and maybe worse. Then consider us eradicated. We're out of here. But I love it here. Look, I think the sun's coming out. Okay, we'll go back to our lame, not deadly universe. But this backpack only shrinks things. Oh, we fiddled with it, and now it makes things bigger. See? Ah, giant gill! Wait, before we go, how did you make your world so perfect? Oh, that's easy. I just... People of Tiny Pork Belly, we have come to destroy uh, uh, Johnny and Dookie. Go! Whoa, didn't see that coming. Am I glad to be back in our world? Really? No. But at least everything's back to normal. Right? Yeah!